We had homework? What? Why am I just now finding out about this? I had no idea we have homework. Why didn't you tell me? God, I'm already doing so bad on this class. I cannot afford to fail another freaking test or miss the homework. I'm gonna get in so much trouble. God. Well, I've been going through a lot lately. I barely have time to do homework or anything like that. Can I copy yours, please? Thank you, you're the best. I promise we can go for like coffee after school, you know, so thank you. And I won't ask again. This is the only time. This is why you're the best. The seat in front of me has been empty for a while now. I wonder if the teacher's gonna make someone else sit here. I know, it feels kind of weird. <laughs> oh. Oh la la. What? No, who is that? was that? I've never seen him before. No? Maybe they transferred here? So cute. What? No, it's just that I know everyone around school and I'm a little offended that I have no clue who this is. Do you know? You don't? Hmm. Fresh meat. God, I hope he sits in front of me. What? The seat's empty, might as well. This is like the only seat he can have anyways. Cut me a break. Will you keep your voice down? Everyone's gonna hear you. What? I'm excited to be friends with someone new. I've never seen anyone new around here. It's always the same people, so... Oh, he's coming. Hey, hi. I guess you heard us mumbling. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be hearing a lot of that, sadly. But you know what? I mean, I don't want to like make you look like a bad student already, but you can totally join our conversation. Well, we were talking about you. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're new, right? Don't think I've ever seen you here before. I know almost everyone around school. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, uh, okay. So why did you transfer here? Oh, gotcha. Well, I'll be your friend and, you know, show you around school if you want. And, uh, you won't be totally new, I guess. Just as long as you hang out with the right group. And I promise we are the right group. I mean, you might hear things about me here and there, but don't believe people. They're just jealous. We're going to be the best classmates ever. But are you smart, though? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I've been sort of failing this class, and, well, a little help would be nice. I mean, we've just met. Yeah, we've just met. Maybe we should ask each other's name first. Oh, sh What, Mr. Stevens? No, we're not being loud. I'm just introducing myself. New student and all that. I mean, yeah, we have to show a good first impression, right? Fine, okay, I'll keep it down. I have no clue. I never did anything. I mean, I've been slacking lately, and I guess he's a little disappointed in me, but gosh. I don't want to get you in trouble. You can turn around if you want. <laughs> no, it's okay. Can I tell you something? Hopefully it doesn't come off as weird or anything. Your hair is, like, <laughs> so nice. Yeah, it looks so soft. 
there's no gel or anything, is there? I mean, I don't want to mess it up. Well, I was wondering if I can play with it, you know, a little bit with my hands, if you'd let me. I'm bored, and I have nothing better to do. Not to mention, I do not want to listen to Mr. Stevens, so... <laughs> it'll give me something fun to do, and, uh... You know? It'll be good for you, too. Kind of like a free head massage. I'm really good at them. Yeah? Oh, shh. Okay, okay. Yeah, just... You can turn around, he won't even see, I promise. Okay. Wow, your hair is so soft. I love it. I could just run my hands through it all day. Oh, look at shampooties. Oh, I've never heard of it. Fancy. No, I think that's kind of attractive. Someone that takes care of themselves and their hair, you know? I like it. <laughs> Does it feel nice? I can tell. You're kind of dozing off a little bit. Come on, don't sleep already. It's your first day. So, uh, have you had a chance to talk to anyone yet? Or? I'm the first? Oh, well, I'm flattered, I must say. And also a little happy that you are sitting in front of me. I was just talking about how boring it's been. You know, everyone has somebody in front of them, and then here I am, just in the middle with nobody in front of me, but here you are occupying the seat. It works perfectly. Hmm? Yeah, I've lived here, like, all my life. I love this town. I mean, I love and hate it, I guess. I love it because I'm used to it, and I know everyone around town, and I'm friends with a lot of people. But I also hate it because I feel like there's nothing new to do or nothing new to explore. I mean, having to come to school every day, doing the same thing every single day, it's kind of boring, you know. Plus... You kind of need the right person to go around and do fun things with. Everyone here is boring. Shh, don't tell her I said that. She'll get mad at me. <laughs> no, but everyone's like in their own bubble, sort of. And they're all about school and work and everything else. They never want to do something fun, you know. But maybe you would want to do something with me? Yeah, I mean, you're new. I can show you around, and we can get to know each other a little better, I can play with your hair a little more outside of class, it's kind of weird now since there's a few eyes on us, <laughs> nah, they don't care, they know better than to say something to me, well, because I have a loud mouth, I can get a little angry, I just don't like when people are all up in my business, you know, and they like to do that a lot, let me tell you, what? I seem like the type of girl that has a lot of friends. Mm, well, I guess you can say I like to have connections and be close to everyone, but I wouldn't really call them my friends. Gosh, I just can't get over your hair. I love playing with it. My fingers literally disappear. That's so nice. Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Stevens, he's weird. He always stares whether you're doing something right or wrong. I swear you can never please that man. <laughs> no, you'll be fine. I have a feeling he likes you already. And plus, he kind of asked for this when he made you sit in front of me. He knows how I can get sometimes a little excited. You know, I promise that I'm a good student. Sometimes. I mean, yeah, I've been slacking a little bit lately. I don't know, I guess... I'm just kind of bored of all this. Ugh, look at me. Being all Debbie Downer all of a sudden. <laughs> Tell me more about you. Uh, like... Why 
did you guys decide to move here? I mean, did you move by yourself? Or are you with your friends, family? You moved here by yourself? Wow. No, that's really impressive. I mean, I... <laughs> I would have never been able to do that. It's mostly because I like to depend on my dad for a lot of that stuff. But... No, I... I think that's really nice, actually. You're ticking a lot of boxes already. Mm, I have like a little checklist in my head every time I meet someone new. It's true, I like to be friends with a lot of people, but there's only a few that I like to get close to. You are making your way into that list, I must say. It does help that you're a little cute, too. And you have really, really soft hair. Like, incredibly soft. I love it. Yeah, of course. But I'll stop playing with it now. I don't want to mess it up too much. You like it? <laughs> well, I'm glad. But maybe we should save that for a time outside of class? What do you think? <laughs> no, you're good. You're good. We're just copying some notes right now, nothing too important, but you should probably turn around and focus. Because he's going to get mad, and I don't want to get you in trouble on day one. Just try to get by these first few days, and then you and I can get into a lot of more trouble. Just don't tell anyone I said that. <laughs> Deal. I'll be more than happy to lend you some of my notes, by the way. I don't have all of them, since I've been missing a few lately, but... <laughs> yeah, I'd be happy to, like, lend you a hand sometime. Cool. Alright, class is starting. <laughs> Pay attention, God. 